Good morning, this is Dave Gleason and it's finally autumn glory time. We've been in harvest for a while and we are so excited to be getting to this point where these apples are ready to eat. And they're great. They really taste good this year. So we'll come back to them in a minute, but right now I'd like to update you on the rest of our harvest. We've been picking lots of apples. We started about the first week of August even and the quality this year is amazing. The flavors have really developed well and, and we're excited about the products that we're gonna to present to you this year. So we finished Galas and, and Goldens and pretty much Red Delicious and we're into Fuji's, Brayburn, Granny's, Pink Ladies are still out there a little ways away and Autumn Glory. Again, the quality of what we're picking this year is great and we have a big spread of different sizes so we're gonna have a little bit for everybody's tastes this year. Again, it, I use the word exciting a lot, but especially now, it's exciting because all year long we've been growing this fruit, watching it apple by apple on the trees, protecting it, uh, giving it the water and nutrients that it needs and watching it. And now we get to put it in the bin and put it into the rest of the system that will finally present that apple to you. And we're hoping and expecting and excited to give you the apples that we're producing this year. So back to the Autumn Glory. We've got an exceptional Autumn Glory apple this year too. I'm really excited about the flavors that we're getting as we eat these apples. It's an interesting process to find something new. Uh, sometimes we're randomly walking through an orchard and a limb on one tree may show some characteristic that we think will have value. So we can select the wood from that and build some trees and then watch to see if it develops into what we want. It's unusual to find something like that. And over the years, uh, that genetic diversity that naturally occurs has led to many different things. Uh, many of the apples that we produce now were, were surprise random finds in different people's orchards or even backyards. But there's also a lot of process that goes in where people are purposefully trying to find and develop those. And that's, that's how Autumn Glory developed. And there's many people that are in that process on a global basis trying to find another new apple that's going to fit our whole system of growing, shipping, packing, uh, and finally, the most important thing, the ability to have an apple that you want to come back and eat more than once, that you want to come back every week and buy some more. So this has been Dave Gleason with another Orchard Update. Thanks for watching.